showing you a tutorial on how to install Windows XP Service Pack 2 on your Mac um, via VMware Fusion. So um, here I have Win uh, VMware Fusion open. You can download it by going to a video which of, of mine which will pop up right now. And you can watch that video once you have VMware Fusion installed. Continue watching this. So you're going to click on new. And in this case I have a um, the ISO file which is the um, Windows XP operating system um, but if you have a CD you can um, insert the CD right now and it will be the same so I'm just gonna hit continue without disk and use operating system so I'm gonna go to my hard drive documents big downloads finish downloads and OS so I have Windows XP Service Pack 2 Pro .iso. Um, so you're going to choose that, hit continue, it automatically um, detects what operating system it is, and if you want to download Windows XP Professional Service Pack 2, um, you can watch a video of mine which will pop up right now also. So um, once you have that, you can do this, um, so you hit continue. Display name George Allegre. You can put a password. And the Windows product key. Um, I don't remember which one it is, so I'm just going to type it in right here. Um, but there will be on the sidebar, on the description, I mean, product key. So you can just enter it in right there. Share home folder if you want, or just none customize settings um, where on my hard drive save it um, so now you can change the settings um, you can um, share your home folder you can change how many CPUs and RAM you have so um, right now I have 512 which is enough for Windows XP, um, accelerate 3D graphics. I'm gonna turn that off, and hard disk size. I'm gonna put um, 12 gigabytes. Um, so that's about it. And then the rest you can put it however you want. So I can close this down already and start up guest. So now you should see this window pop up, and you're gonna go through all the Windows installation, which on VMware Fusion it's much is much easier than on Bootcamp, because it's all it's almost um, everything automatically done by VMware Fusion. And a nice feature about VMware Fusion is that it also um, allows you to install McAfee Windows um, antivirus, so it's very um, cool. So I'm going to go through all the installation right now and I'll show you how it looks once it's done. So obviously the formatting goes really fast since it's a virtual disk. Now it's going to start copying some files, and I'm going to go back. Um, it's 15 when, hours. When this is over. Okay, so it's about to be done. Um, now setup is going to start, and uh, you're going to be able to. Well, right now it says restarting computer, but it's actually going to just close down VMware Fusion and start up um, since it's a virtual machine. Now you're going to go through the setup and everything, and it should be pretty easy. So, Q 
here we have the setup now you're gonna have to wait 39 minutes for this to be over but um, I'm gonna come with the, when this is over and show you how it looks like okay guys so I'm here in the middle of the setup and it's now asking me for a product key so here I have a video of mine called download Windows XP and everything and I have the product keys in the sidebar so I'm gonna put that in um, the key I gave you in the beginning of the video doesn't work for some reason so now I'm gonna type this one in DP7CM PD6MC 6BKXT M8JJ6 RPXG J. So hit next, and this one does work. So if you have any problems, um, don't worry. Just answer that one right there. One of these two should work. Um, so now I can close this. Um, the, um, the serial number is going to be on the description. I mean the product key. Um, I don't know why for some reason the one I put in the beginning of the video didn't work but it doesn't matter um, I put it in now and it does work so don't worry um, so now I'll just continue through the installation of the Windows XP okay guys so Windows um, just did the boot up sky, uh, chime I mean um, and it says applying your personal settings so um, this was much easier than doing it on boot camp the only thing I had to do during the installation was um, enter my product key um, so now Windows installer should pop up because it's going to install Windows um, I mean VMware tools so um, you're going to wait for that to install and display settings um, uh, you can hit yes hit yes and you can see it works perfectly um, you can close that now you can install or use Microsoft and do whatever you want with it um, so this is going to install VMware tools Um, and I'm gonna come back on this server. Okay guys, so here I'm back with Windows and um, it like restarted automatically. So now you can see right here you can install Mac um, Cathy Virus Scan Plus for free for one year. So you can install it if you want or just um, remind later. So now you're gonna enter your password. VMware tools right here so you can also go full screen I'm going to toggle that in and you can see the um, the quality remains um, very good the the resolution so now you can do whatever you want in um, Microsoft I mean Windows um, it doesn't really have a lot of things right now and it's kind of old it has the old Internet Explorer um, the old Windows um, Messenger but you can install um, Microsoft Office if you want or um, some other software you want so um, that's about it for this tutorial um, here you can toggle some things for example um, eyesight uh, but you have to install bootcamp drivers so I'll, maybe I'll show you a tutorial on how to do that later um, so now you can see right here in the bottom what's being used like the hard drive the CD and the share folders and if you have um, any Microsoft um, soft software on your Mac you can go to your shared folders right here and there you see George on my Mac and here you have all your folders and files on your Mac so if you have it on your documents for example um, you can copy them and do whatever you want with them.
so that's about it for this video guys i hope you guys like this tutorial remember to comment rate subscribe and follow me on twitter and goodbye